Eric Stewart, I, my phone's been ringing, brother. My phone's been ringing, brother. They said you need to talk to Eric Stewart. That's an all cage, brother. Give me that phone. I grabbed my phone and I said, I said, listen here, brother. You're a fan. I'm a fan of you. If you're a fan of the BEG TV, let's go. That's what we're talking about. Yeah. All right, welcome back, folks. We are back. We are here for another episode of BEG Wrestling. And we have ourselves some new guests. Why don't you go down the line and introduce yourself? How you guys doing? I'm Drew Barnes. I'm 30 years old, and you think <laughs> wrestling is my go-to? You just say, you got, I have a lot in store for you. <laughs> what? I don't what? know. I don't know. <laughs> now, wait, oh, wait, wait, uh, wait. 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 I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> it's my first time. <laughs> All right, uh, we picked this girl up off the streets. Hi, I'm Jamie, and I'm 31. What? <laughs> Why are we doing our <laughs> Why are we doing no one cares? the female wrestling guru. Guru. Look, YouTube guru. said we need 6% female. We got it. We got we it. We have 6% female viewership. Yes, we, we recognize that as a problem. Okay. Yeah. Right? Solution. Here's a solution. Solution. Yeah. Right here. Yep. Oh, right. wait. Wait. Time out. Why is Jamie here? Good, great question. That. <laughs> she, come on. Great question. I mean, you, you're pretty, but you don't know nothing about wrestling. I, I, come on. Are you kidding me? Yeah, this isn't uh, the knew. WWE, okay? <laughs> let's, let's be real. I don't even, that uh, doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> well, prove it. Yeah. Prove yourself then. I don't know. Okay. okay. That's your question. I, just, I heard a rumor she's a female Shane Sparks. <laughs> Wow. All right, let me well, say something. It's probably going to her way. Okay. <clears throat> Throw away. Carter Scarachi and Aaron Brooks are going for title number four mm -hmm. next year, mm -hmm. which there's not many of them. Is there any studs coming along that could possibly win four? Well, I think it's unlikely um, that we have any four timers just because a lot of the best of the best is within the same weight range. And we're looking between 157 and 165. <clears throat> Some of those people, we have Levi Haynes for Penn State. We have Cody Chittum for Iowa. Meyer Shapiro from Cornell. Yeah. Um, Anthony Ferrari from Iowa. And Mitchell Messenbrick from who? We're not sure. He's still in the portal. <laughs> but they're all going to be oh, yeah, battling that. And... We have the war going on between the two 85ers, between Nick Fettelman from Ohio State. You mean Feldman? <laughs> Close enough. Right. Well, listen. Okay. Names are on right. a special team. Okay. Yeah, exactly. All right. We mess up names once in a while here. Calm, calm yourself down. We have Christian <laughs> Carroll from um, Oklahoma State. Okay. And we have <laughs> Ben Keeter from Iowa. Which, Tudor? okay, let, let's be honest. Yeah, Keeter, it is Keter. Keter. It is Keter, wow. thank you. Let's be honest, though. He's probably got one or two years, and then he's going to be in full-time football. Whoa. So, Get yeah. Out. They need all the help they can. Exactly. You prepped her. All yeah. right, you prepped yeah. her. It's all in this. It's all in Please. this. Please. <laughs> I'm, I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Thank I'm you. impressed. Q WWF spokesperson <laughs> right now. Oh, yeah. Uh, me? Yeah. What do you think about that? <laughs> I say I can't tell you how impressed I am <laughs> by what this girl just did right now. That's incredible. Wow. Absolutely yeah. unbelievable. That was impressive. The energy. All right, uh, Drew's Why turn. Was. How much do I know? I, I, will, I will throw a couple fun facts of the wrestling talk here. The Nick Feldman, Ohio State heavyweight Buckeye. There hasn't been a Buckeye. Let's be real. Sammy Sasso, trash. Okay? Irrelevant. Never wins a big one. You got it's coming back. who's the other guy, Wayne, the Heinzelman. How many bad wrestle matches have we seen that guy in? Well, the one twenty five pounder. Uh, yeah, sure. You know, I mean, but bad. you're right. They bad, haven't had a good heavyweight. Guy. Well, they had all uh, the AA guy, but uh, he's So let me tell you the AA guy's name. <laughs> I'll Google it and I'll let you know. But I'll tell you right now. <laughs> Nick Feldman, finally they get back on the map at heavyweight since Kyle Snyder. By the way, a wood buying guy from Maryland, about 20 minutes from where we live. So, how? Who, just saying. Al Brooks from Maryland, too? He's a Hagerstown kid, Aaron? yeah. Brooks, a Hagerstown boy? Yeah. Since when is Maryland it's, reading these? Technically, maybe, maybe, maybe Maryland. Or North at Ohio State has AA'd twice, but 
no real threat to win. Hmm. Nothing against you, Orndorff. You were a fine wrestler, but let's be honest. Orndorff. No... That's what I call him. <laughs> 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 All right. What, okay, you named a lot of big uh, recruits coming impressive. in this year. That was impressive. Uh Wayne, what do you rank your top incoming yeah. freshmen? Yeah. Talk about some of these incoming yeah. freshmen. I hear a lot of these names going to Iowa. I don't hear a lot going to Penn State. No, that's true. Well, that's be honest. Know. How many every year we got these big names coming in, and then they turn out. To, I'm not saying they're bad. I'm just saying they're not turning out to be these possible four timers. That every year you got all these expectations. Well, this kid could be a four timer. Uh, boy, you hear a lot of that from Iowa nowadays right. between the Ferraris and the, the Keaters and the Arnolds. And, and this kid could be a four-timer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Just hold back a little bit. <laughs> but with that said, between uh, Chittam and Messenbrink, um, yeah, they're serious. So we have no idea where Messenbrink's going. We know Chittam's going yeah, to Iowa. Yeah, we don't have any insight on that. I nothing. cannot see how... Iowa could even squeeze Messenbrink in there. I'm looking at that. I don't know yeah. how it's possible. Yeah. Yeah, because Messenbrink or, or Ferrari's going to take up like 65 or 57. I'm thinking probably 65. Yeah. Yeah. I could be wrong there um, because remember, they got Kennedy at 65. So it's not going to be Ferrari Iowa. might be down at 57. Here's my case why all these big recruits for Iowa really didn't help them that much is you bring in a great Ferrari. Well, you're going to have to sit Seabrick on the, the bench if Ferrari can beat him. Mm -hmm. How much of an improvement is that? By the way, we're already taking a bit of a hit down at 125 because um, even Iowa, even though he's probably going to be an AA, he's no Spencer Lee. And then you got another up, up high, we got Keeter coming in. Well, Cass is coming back. Can Keeter even beat Cass? Sure. And let's all not forget, Keeter did the interview and said, I'm going to have to eventually choose one or the other eventually. He said that himself in the interview. So, I mean, personally, the fact that you said you eat like two years, I'm with you on that. Yeah. I'm thinking a year or two in foot in wrestling. And if he's doing well in football and someone's are, is putting in his yeah. ear, hey, look, mm -hmm. you're looking like an NFL. -er. Yeah. Or, or mm -hmm. that doesn't happen. And he's at Iowa four years. That's true. That's a true. A better version of a Mason Paris type. Looks like a, a football player out there. And, and you act like Ferrari has a chance to not come on. For, AJ, I'm talking about AJ Ferrari. Physically reminds me of uh, oh, who's the uh, Golden Gopher heavyweight? Oh, you talking just, about uh, just graduated? Gable. Just one, yeah, Gable, Gable Stevenson. Stevenson. Yeah. Physically, just utter dominance. Yeah, they're winning. Ferrari's beating Brooks if he's in that weight class right now. Oh, I heard it was just a sport or a uh, sour Penn State fans. What it sounded like. Yeah, let's talk about all those Penn I State. Like Steve coming over from this corner. <laughs> a lot. Of <laughs> I mean, oh, man. Well, Can we make two quick hot take here? You go. Here's the first one. Does Ben Keeter even wrestle at all this year? Because we all know how football no. affects the yeah, body. Yeah, that's true. Dislocated shoulder. Right. You're going to be getting hits two a days. This guy is not going to want to go to the wrestling mat after that. There's no way. Yep. Let me tell you right now. Brains is going to do all he can to keep that guy in the weight room, in the wrestling room. Hawkeyes need that football help, too. So that's going to be a battle inside the school of where he should play. The other hot take is Anthony Ferrari, let me tell you, buddy, I don't think you're going to wrestle, period, ever again. You're, you're grimy, man. You're grimy. <laughs> Which, uh, well, like why don't you know? <laughs> don't like it. No, Google. No, that's his Whoa. brother, AJ. Whoa, now, AJ. this is Anthony. Yeah, Anthony's a young Tomato, brother. tomato, buddy. <laughs> apple don't far, far from the tree. We're yeah, blowing you guys away with <laughs> facts over here. Let's go. <laughs> Fact check it. Don't feel my leg and tell me it's raining. Yeah. Was it was a phone last night, AJ. <laughs> Dang. Go. Oh, right. yeah. wow. uh, yeah. Well, the whole Ferrari thing. Uh, yeah, I mean, Can I we will on... get into the specifics of what Can exactly I occurred there. Can I on my uh, AJ theory? Yeah. <laughs> okay, it was too here's my theory. Tell me if I'm wrong. Okay. I could be wrong. You're probably wrong. <laughs> I'm probably wrong. It's a good okay. AJ wants to wrestle so badly that 
my theory is if this girl in this whole uh, sex case has decent evidence, they're going to come to AJ with a, a plea. He cannot take that plea. Or he will not. No school will take him if he took a plea. Am I wrong? It'd be hard there? to take him. Well, yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, we You're saw gonna get blasted. We if, saw Oklahoma State handled it. Any kind of news around it, they said, "We well, don't want him. See ya. We don't want yeah. him." Yeah. So yeah. Yeah. nothing. AJ's attorney and AJ's arrogance himself. He thinks. In fact, he's on Twitter now saying, "I'm. I'll be back next year, dude. You got a little bit of an issue. You got to get by first. Yeah. I think he will not take a plea in the effort to wrestle again. He may end up landing himself in jail, which probably is right if right. this is but all true. true absolutely. Yeah, let's not get uh, so he's going to end up, his love for wrestling is going to cost him to the point he may go to jail yeah. for it. Yeah. Wow. yeah. Very, very well could. That is dedication. But I, I don't know. I was got to go war. That's just a theory. Now that sounds like an Iowa wrestler to me. <laughs> dedication. Yeah, they're dedicated. Uh, we are there. Any of these uh, uh, freshmen coming in have a chance at a, being a four timer? <laughs> Who has the best chance? Chatham? Messenbrink? I don't like it. I'm with Jamie. I don't like any of them at the 57 65 range. Because they're going to have to deal with each right. other. They're best against yeah. the best. Yeah. And you say, well, Messenbrink beat Levi in that, uh, what was it? Uh, you, good. What was it? U17? In that, uh, no. I, I forget what it was. It was freestyle. It was close. Mm -hmm. But, uh, and I'm just saying, them two are very, very close. And Messenbrink's the real deal. Where is he going? Would Penn State be able to use him? Wow. If he's at 57, maybe. Mm -hmm. he he Hit him. He's gone, and at the Open International Tournaments, he's going out, and he's getting runner-up fin finishes wow. at the se senior level. Wow. Mm -hmm. And he didn't go to college yet. So wow. yeah. now that doesn't guarantee he's going to be unbelievable at folk, folk style. This is, yeah. that's, you see that once in a while. Somebody's tearing it up in freestyle, yeah, and you go to folk style, and all of a sudden... Mm -hmm. yeah, Carter Young kind of reminds me of that. Different, yeah. yeah. Carter Young. Can I ask Young. a question about the rumors of Truex joining Penn State? Could I, be hope, I hope they're true, and it makes big sense help. because Truex weighed in light all year long. Truex could actually go eighty-four, mm -hmm. which that really opens things up because all of a sudden, if Brooks wants to stay at eighty-four, we got Truex at ninety-seven. If Brooks wants to go up to ninety-seven, we got Truex down at eighty-four. Yeah, true. Now, Truex only has one year left, but um, I like the way that feels. I'll be keep. I'll, although, you know what? I don't like transfers in. I like homegrown. Yeah, grow them up. I'm picking yeah. on Iowa all this time, getting yeah, my wallet sounds, out. Let's go buy like some. Guys. Now all of a sudden, I'm a hypocrite. Yeah. Yeah. Wallet out. It sounds like Iowa's like the New York Yankees. Yes, you know, let's go buy the championship. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. You see that loud now? Well, it's not working. Yeah, no, it's not now working. Jamie. Sure ain't. Yeah. If you were doing it all over again, this uh, women's wrestling is just coming. It's yeah. making this uprise. Yeah, it would goodness. you wrestle? <laughs> I think I would. I think I would. Wow. I think I would. Wow. I feel like, you know, the empowerment. And I think I think I could have been good. Think yeah. Well, you have a daughter. Good. You have a daughter. She's, yeah. Maybe she'll be a wrestler. Hey, She's folks, a fighter. daughter, son-in-law. Yeah. They have two kids. They have a boy and a girl. Mm -hmm. Jamie, you grew up in a wrestling house. I did. You grew up in a wrestling house. In a wrestling house, and let me tell this you, this was a wrestling man. I was on the back school. burner. <laughs> let me tell you. <laughs> no, that's oh, not yeah. true. Oh yeah. I quit, and I was throwing those. balls out in that backyard for him, with you, trying that's to get true. you to get good at softball. I will vouch for he Jamie on this. Can I vouch on Jamie on this? There was a home video of her in the <laughs> pool at the the community pool up here, and she goes, "Dad, Dad, Dad, look at me, look at me." He goes, "What, Jamie?" Yeah. Don't you remember the video? He was, he was looking at his wrestler son. Yeah. yeah. He said, no. Corey was That's doing burpees not true. In, the, in the kiddie pool. I was never good enough. If only they had girl <laughs> wrestling at the time. Yeah. Ba, 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 ba. A lot of talk around here. Look, she got babied. That's Zach. Did she get babied? I was I mean, toughest on Zach. 
I thought yeah. I gotta learn. That's why I'm tough as now. <laughs> <laughs> it's real tough. That's funny. <laughs> You hear something from the peanut gallery over there. <laughs> wow. Is that uh, a daggone acid reflux Kelly over there? <laughs> <That's amazing. laughs> it's, it's flying all around. ARK over there. <laughs> what are we looking for next year? Like with, with Penn State, like where are we standing? With Ohio State, where do you think we're standing? Like are we in the same position? Is anybody creeping up to the top that we don't think about? Is well, like, what, what are we thinking? Let's see where all these portals land. Okay, after all the money's done being thrown around okay. and bought and buying, that's see after the dust settles. Mm -hmm. But right now, if you were to ask me, of course Penn State is again next year going to be huge favorites. Yeah, for sure. I'm going to say Cornell is, mm. and I'll tell you one thing about Cornell is the last time I heard a, a wrestler really brag about a youngster that was coming in, it was when Mark Hall bragged about Carter Storacci. He kept saying, this Storacci's the real deal. And I thought, you know, that's teammates being yeah. nice to each other. Yeah. Well, as we've seen, uh, Mark Hall knew what he was talking about. Well, Yanni's out there talking about the Shapiro so much. Mm. Shapiro's going to be unbelievable. <sighs> Okay, I'll buy. I'll buy in. Talent is talent. Mm -hmm. I, I'm yeah. sure he's very good, but so good that he could hit the ground as a national champ year one. Well, Carter did it, so I'm not going to say it's ridiculous, but like again, he's going to be in a tough little weight range. Is yeah. remember at 65, at least for another year, is both Carr and O'Toole is going to be back. Yeah. So. They're going to have to stay down to 57, which that might be tough for some of them. Uh, but it'll be interesting. Uh, I know Chittum plans on being it. Yeah, what's his weight? I think Chittum is 49. Yeah. Chittum's 49, but he may end up 57. Ooh. But uh, Shapiro, Man, Levi, Shapiro's at 57, same. listed at 57 this year. And uh, Ferrari is listed at, what is he listed at? 57? I think he's 57 also. Messenbrink, I'm not sure where he's at, whether he's 57 or 65. He's one or the other. But oh, That'd be something. Levi, Chittum, and Messenbrink all at 57 next year. Oh, my. Yeah. I'm anxious to see. See, I think Levi made stri uh, gains. Do we think he keeps the gains or does he regress? Was this a flash in a pan, or no. just steady consistency? No. no, because you could see in his wrestling, his yeah, positioning is so sound. Yeah. yeah. And we all kind of agreed that in that finals, well, I don't want to take any credit away from O'Connor. Uh, O'Connor obviously is very good. Yeah. But it's almost like he had the power to yeah, prevent. And, you know, Haynes made some mistakes in that finals match, but... For the most part, Haynes is so good with his positioning, and he's just so technically sound that uh, it's not a flash in a pan mm -hmm. kind of guy. He's going to be around. Be around but yeah. uh, it, you say, well, he got runner-up as a freshman. He's going to be a three-timer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not automatically. Yeah, not with what's coming down the pike. Yeah. He could be, but anyway. Hmm. What about a couple other schools? Nebraska on the rise. They kind of just always around that four or five. Well, six. The, uh, I'm putting barely. I'm putting Cornell as number two right now, and uh, Iowa and M Missouri. And Ohio State. Ohio State. And Ohio State. State up them three State are recruits. right there mm -hmm. in the mix too. But I think Cornell, if especially if Spyro turns out to be, because they're solid. Yeah, they lose uh, Yanni, but. If Sapiro replaces Yanni, uh, pretty much they got everybody back. Listen, if we know one thing about Cornell, they're big red bears. <laughs> <laughs> and you don't match the big red bear. Let's go. All right. We've all heard some weird wrestling stories, had some weird ref wrestling experiences. What is uh, the most odd or unique wrestling story or experience that you have had? I seen that one wrestler, poor guy. That RBY match? He must not felt well. And don't tell me. 
<laughs> I'm just saying, it was a. I hope a, it wasn't a white singlet. A yeah. mess, materialized. Yeah. That's what I'm. Like. And it went, ended up, it went down his legs and everything. And here he is in front of the whole gym. I mean, what do you do? Just sprint off the mat at that point? Transfer portal. <laughs> Transfer you go to the portal and you don't come back out. I was like, he's like Paul Pierce in the NBA. He faked the injury. He got wheel. Wheel carted off and then came back just fine. Yeah. Said, Can we well, question the Lamar Jackson basketball yeah, game? Yeah, he had IV oh, cramps. That's right. Yeah. No belly cramps. Oh. Oops. Whatever. Wow. Maybe it's he good. ran into the locker room, didn't he? Video evidence of it. Yeah. Oh, came back and scored the game touchdown. Mm, man, that's. But. I got an oil change this morning, right after getting my morning coffee. Not my typical routine. Wow. You want to talk about close calls? Bad planning, if you ask me. <laughs> I won't make that mistake again. Wow. <laughs> yeah. All right. Well, that it. This conversation um, just explains the difference between the men who dream of being on the podium and the men who Whoa. are on the podium. Whoa. Right? Whoa. I mean, come on. You know, what happens? When a podcast gets slow, <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I feel like we're what on that time zone so episode. Explain to me that episode of Seinfeld where Start Kramer pitching. has the uh, the uh, show stage and they're all just sitting there like, oh, yeah, this is dead. Let's get a new set. He pulls the light. I am the generic brand of wax beans. You know, I rip off the label. I can hardly tell the difference. <laughs> I'm officially bottomed out. <laughs> Who's our next guest? We got no one. We need a new format. We should shut down and retool. That Aaron Lee's and Kramer's still sitting there like. <laughs> Someone help. The Mar Marv Griffin show. Uh, All right. Well, listen, we got more great yeah, content was good. to come. <laughs> yeah, this will be well, you like this. You're really going to like our next <laughs> step. <laughs> we got some good stuff. What right, so what we got coming up? This is all awesome. who's, who's the uh who's the salesman that likes the show? He's a WWF fan. What's his name? Again? Eric Stewart. Eric Stewart. Eric Stewart. Yeah. Thank you, Eric How about Stewart. Drew? How about you cut a piece? Eric Stewart, I, my phone's been ringing, brother. My phone's been ringing, brother. They said you need to talk to Eric Stewart. That's an all came, brother. Give me that phone. I grabbed my phone and I said, I said, listen here, brother. You're a fan. I'm a fan of you. If you're a fan of the BG TV, let's go. That's what we're talking about. Yeah. yeah. Uh, woo. Woo. We were in the middle of our tournament where my friend John said he found a body in the bushes over there. I ran over there, because I'm a healing monk, to try and help, but obviously my magic wasn't strong enough because the dude's body was missing a head. So my friend decided to try and use a necromancer spell, which didn't work, which I knew it wouldn't. And apparently we contaminated the crime scene because that spell uses a lot of glitter. Shapiro, Shapiro. 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 Shapi